Good day to you one and one. Welcome back to the channel. And if you're a new viewer of this channel, greetings, welcome. I hope you like the content enough to uh, want to subscribe. It is free to do so and it is greatly appreciated. It helps with the growth of the channel and everything like that. Radio, we are back with Cricket 2024, or AKA okay, just Cricket 24. And we're just going to have a, a little looky loo. Come on, game, you can do it. Yeah, it's one of these, you know. Yeah, you got to have a specific window. Yeah, there we go. Look at that. Just like that. Memory. Memory of an old dog. Anyway, it's a greetings to chat and uh, on YouTube. Linus, Shaleen, how are you guys doing? Good to see you, as always. And the obligatory links right now in chat. There you go, guys. If you want to support other content creators, you know what to do. Head on over to those channels and give them a like and a sub and whatever it is. If you like content more than mine, don't ever come back here again. Simple as that. Right here, we are back with Cricket 24, as I say. We're going to do a little bit of a different look uh, today. Today, we're going to have a look down at um, the different formats. Not so much the different formats, but the different competitions and what you can do in uh, Cricket 24. So we got this play the hundred men's or women's season. I have no, I never heard of that, so I've got no idea what that is. Um, so maybe we'll have a look at that. Then we know that this is the the BBL, the Bish Bag, the Big Bash League, Bish Bash Bush, whatever, Big Bash League it down under in Australia, the KFC, and then you get the the weather. It's the women's Big Bash League. And uh, then we got the Indian T20 League. That is pretty much a copy of what is meant to be the Indian Premier League, I take it. Uh, obviously licensing, they can't uh, say much about you know using those kind of names. Then we get the CPL. Uh, that's the Caribbean Premier League. Downs, West Indies and such. Um, and then we get the PSL, which is the Pakistani, um, or the Pakistan Super League. And then it is the Dream 11 Super Smash. I think that is, I'm not sure if that is UK based or uh, Aussie based. I cannot remember for the life of me. And then obviously we get the uh, standard regular competition based, um, which I guess is, wait, where's the, the World Cup there? Okay, so that's the World Championship there. So basically the Cricket World Cup, otherwise known as CWC. South Africa have never won it. Poor form. And then we get a competition. I guess this is, uh, you can set up your own competition. This is the one that I want to do the most. This one, the tour. Uh, like I said in the previous um, stream, I love um, Brian Lara Cricket on the PS2. Or was it PS3? I think it was PS2. Or even PS1 maybe. Uh, that's PlayStation for those that don't know. Um, that, setting up a tour, and doing like three, four months tour was absolutely the gem of the game. And I'm so glad that they've got it in here. Uh, whether or not it's, um, you know, worthwhile, if it's going to be nice, I don't know. The rest of the menu is pretty much a standard. You can go in and um, go to the Cricket Academy, which is online, and you can get teams. And I guess that's a good place to s sometimes to start off because... Um, you can get the names of the players in the standard regular version of Cricket 24 are altered because of licensing, but these are basically mods in the Cricket Academy online, and you can probably download better kits, better teams, venues, uh, different types of bats and um, outfits and, and whatnot, and team kits and stuff like that. So that's that's pretty cool. Um, I do like that. Like I say, there you go. There's player editors, even the umpire editors. Bloody hell. Okay, I didn't realize that. And then we've got logo creators and, and nice. Nice. I, I like that. That is pretty cool. That's very, very cool. But yes, that is probably one of the, be the best things. However, I don't do it because it just takes up way too much time. You've got to go through every single player. And change their names uh, and via controller that's horrible it's not fun although you can use a keyboard but team editor you can download uh, the, where is the downloading actually uh, where is it 
And there we go. Search your community. Communicate. Uh, search your community and find what you need to find. That's very, very cool. I like that. But that is the one thing that um, will take this tour will take an incredible amount of time. You could choose your team and you got to play each game. So in this particular iteration of video, we're not going to be doing that. However, we might look at something like that. The IPL is extremely popular at the Indian Premier League. Um, unless they have changed it, the Indian T20 League, have they changed the name? I don't know. It's always been the IPL as far as I can remember. Eesh, um, you know what? Fuck it. Let's have a look and see what it's like. Okay, so we can do SA Women's in Australia. Okay, so we can't create a new one. Interesting. Oh, there is. Wait, it says create to a designer. There we go. Sorry, my bad. Um, damn it. Create new. Why would I want to... Why are you bringing this up? Stupid game. Give me... I want to create a new one. I don't know. I'm certainly not going to play as... Uh, South Africa. Oh, that's a bit annoying. Let's play a tour or create a custom tour. Well, let me create a custom tour then, you muppet. Create new managed tours tour designer. Okay, gives you the same thing. Create new. Gives you the same thing. It's bloody daft. Manage tours. Nothing to manage because we haven't started anything. That is stupid. Okay, so I guess we've got to kind of make a new one. Select that and then... What? Stupid game. Yeah, that's, that's, um, well, that sucks. So maybe that's something that they're still working on then. Yeah, delete that. You don't want that. Tour designer. Okay, men's tour. Here we go. Okay. Okay, host team. Okay. Uh, should we play in South Africa? Let's have a look, see, see if they've got... I should have, there we go, South Africa. Okay, touring team. I'm gonna choose an absolute diabolically shit team to come and play. Let's get, let's get uh, Maple Boy and uh, to play cricket in South Africa. It's the only way I can get uh, Q to come to uh, thingy. What are we gonna call it? There we go. M the Maple Tour. <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah, okay. Whatever. Okay, let's have a look. Um, okay, add competition, add warm-up. Ooh, okay, we can do a warm-up. Okay, match type, no. It's going to be a... Oh, come on, man. If it's in South Africa... We're going to, let's do, okay, so we can change it to, okay, we can play against our, our own team. Okay. There we go. Okay, and then Sunday we'll play the first game. This is going to be fun. A five match test series. Ooh. Uh, four match ashes. Okay, let's let's add a a three. Can we not add a three? Okay, so that's the series three match T twenty series. There we go. So T twenty is a very quick format. Um, very exciting. Uh, but I do love my Test cricket. So we'll give them a break, and then we'll go into. Right, let's add some. Yeah, no, give him a break. Thursday, we're gonna do a five-match test series. There we go. Holy shit! K. 
here, wait. <laughs> so it's a five day. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, so we delete. Oh, come on. That's a bit silly. Five match test series. Okay, then let's just do one. Bloody hell. There we go. And then we'll add another one here. Yeah. Okay, next month. See, this is this is the the when they used to do a lot of tours. It's crazy. I don't want to add a warm up. Why must I add a warm up for another month? What? Wait, what ground do they got at us? They playing at Durban, and then Durban. Override ground, yes. Oh god, okay. Uh, we got Durban, it's on the east coast. Okay, where's Cape Town? The Newlands, we're gonna go to Newlands. There we go, so that's Newlands. That's interesting. It's funny that you've got to add a warm up. Okay, whatever. Um, Pretty strange. Okay. Okay, then we can add another test series. Why do they keep telling him to add a warm up? What is going on here? I don't want to add a warm up. Oh, that's fucking stupid. Come on, game. Okay, so screw that then. We're not going to do that. That is just absolutely ridiculous. Delete that. That is silly. Okay. That's, that, that is like a big no-no for me then. That is so annoying. Because, put it this way. Um, those that understand cricket, right? You will know that you don't play a five test series. Um, talking about tests. Each test is... Or three tests here. It doesn't matter how many. It's either three or five, because you got to have odd to be to find a winner. Um, you cannot play a th let's say example a three test series. Each test series is five days long, depending on how the game goes. Of course, it could be three, it could be four, it could be five, whatever. Um, you do not play them consecutively, like this game, as just thrown out there. You saw there, it filled up the entire month or the, the bottom portion of the month with a test with another test and a test it's just imp you wait a week you know for the players to recuperate and stuff like that you don't just play them consecutively so that is fucking stupid big ant you got that horribly wrong secondly why would you go into the uh the next month because generally these tours last two months three months why do you have to go into the next month and set up a warm-up game and then carry on it's stupid adding another warm-up game no no I want to carry on with the next test unless there's a way of um, see it's just so stupid okay crit mains tour okay whatever okay it doesn't matter who it is let's have a look at the calendar Okay, so we want to add competition and let's do a five match test. Try and look at that. You don't ever, ever, ever see that. Ever. Okay, so and it doesn't tell you on the right hand side if it's test two, test whatever. So you got to go, well, there's three. And that's where the next one starts. So we're going to move that. That, that is just so stupid. So you gotta do that. That is just ridiculous. Okay, the Gabba, Adelaide, Adelaide, Adelaide. 
beginning of the GABA, it's there. And you can't even change it to, so you gotta change that one first. It's just ridiculous. And then this one, move it along like that. It's there, and then move this one. Okay, so this is Sydney. You can move this one down there, like that or like that or whatever it that is just ridiculous that you have to do that and then you got to go in and and over if you don't want to play at a certain ground you got to change the ground so this gets off oh, fuck's sakes move oh my god i want to move it in muppet there yeah no i don't like that format it, it's um it's very annoying no one ever does that. Ever. That is not very user friendly. Sorry, Big Ant. But you failed miserably on that, and that is such a huge disappointment. Don't like that. And again, this is my opinion, of course, don't forget. So that is a big disappointment. Uh, let's have a look at uh, the IPL, a new Indian T20 league. Let's see what they do. Play as a team star player. That's interesting. All teams, star player, who are we going to choose? Rohit Sharma is so good, it's crazy. Uh, Quinton de Kock from South Africa, he's great. Uh, well, it's interesting that he's number three. I don't think he should be there, number three, personally. But he's a good player. I would have thought there'd be a lot other better players above him. Because I don't think he had a very good IPL this season. Or last season, or whatever. Morning, the way I in. Sorry, I'm just sipping on me coffee. So the structure of the menu is, is is not great. I mean, the structure of the menu is great, but the um, the tour inside of it is not very good. Very disappointed. Okay, let's just get into it. It'll be interesting to play as a, a top line player rather than play my own player. So let's play a match and see how it looks. Oh, that looks like David Warner. I bet it probably is. Okay, first things first. Let's mute that. And let's go. This will be interesting. Hello and welcome, one and all. You join us for this 2020 match between the Delhi Capitals and Lucknow. I'm Adam Gilchrist and with me in commentary today David is Warner. Michael Atherton, nice. Mel Jones and the one and only... This is going to be a true indication of um, if it's just a cut and paste game over at uh, Cricket 22. The pitch seems to suit it. Good call to bowl first. It certainly looks like there'll be something early on for the bowlers. The openers will really need to keep things tight in the early overs. Players making their way out. It's a great crowd in today with plenty of atmosphere around this ground. Plenty of wickets on offer and runs. Batters and bowlers are in the game. And there's some quality players in both teams. So I'm expecting an even contest. Let's see what happens. We're about to get underway and already oh, yeah, the looking, crowd is up and about. Shit. This is looking to be a great day of cricket. Square cut, finds point, no run. I forgot. I was going to say, there's nowhere to skip it, but thank fuck there is. Coming to the wicket, they'll be looking to play within the V early and expand as they get settled. Oh my god, he's left-handed. I totally forgot. Beats oh, the bat. Jeez, how does that miss the stumps? Peach of a delivery. Holy hell, okay. Shit, this is different. Straight drive, mid-off, and cut that one off. 
I to see Drench hi from India. How you doing, man? Playing a little bit of IPL at the moment. Okay, so top line players um, are vastly different compared to where I am in the club at the moment. Jeepers, okay. You read Coley, of course you are. <laughs> of course you are. Dug that out well. Things have been kept relatively quiet here. Another good over comes to an end. Yada. Ahmed, the slow left armour is coming into the attack from the pavilion end. I am from your arch nemesis, South Africa. <laughs> Oh God, that was a tremendous here. delivery. Oh Fizz through to the keeper. No more short balls yeah. this over. We'll take their runs for whichever way we can get it. 57 from 30. This is going to be a little bit on the tighter side. Yes. Ah, uh, yes, yes. You guys do love A.B. A B. de Villiers. Of course you do. He was an absolute genius. Absolute genius. He, re he retired York here, way coming too back early. on here. They've been bowling really well so far. Come on now. They're running out of runs, out of time. We need more balls. Always need more balls. 44 from 21. Oof. Where we going, buddy? Where we going? Beats uh, the outside edge. Good ball in there. This should be wide. Thank you very much. I have not watched IPL in uh, a fair while. No. Finds the fielder with that shot. Needs oh, to be on target. No, no. Beats the cup of field. Nice shot. There we go. That is a masterclass of batting. Reads the length, gets forward, dispatches it to the boundary. Good How will he reply? Yeah. That's a cracking shot. That's going to be six. It's going way back into the crowd there. That's just a brilliantly aggressive shot. Gets onto the front foot and it's flown over the boundary. That's the over. What possible? Right, 27 from 12. Holy mother. All right, let's see. Nice shot. Straight back and to straight the ball. Straight to the ball. Oh, well, that ball has been hit. Nice. It's flown into the crowd. To get that much power coming forward onto the front foot, it's just ridiculous. Lovely cover drive, straight to the extra cover field. Um, I don't really have an uh, SN Patel, back on uh, now. T20 favourite. <laughs> um, the Cape Cobras, I guess, could be one of them. Huge, that has flown. Just missed the line. Delivery, but that was dispatched with interest. Everyone just watched that in awe. Right, what are we seeing there? Have to go for it now. Yep. Magic Q, how are you doing, man? Six from three balls. Oh, they really need a boundary, this ball. Straight ah, to the field. Ah, damn it. Uh, South Africa doesn't have a chance, mate. Yep. Not, not, not going to try it. 
five from one ball. It's got to hit a six, man. Dude, you got to hit a six. You got to hit a six, Last man. Last ball. What can they conjure? Hit a six, dude. You got nothing left to lose. Hit it. Oh wow, that Run. is out of here. That Run. could be out of the ground. That's, well, that's it. what you six. pay your entrance money for. Yes. <laughs> Team, I hope you've enjoyed the match. Ended up being a very close one. Hope to see you soon. That was tight. That was very, very tight. Tight, 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 yeah! Hey. So that's a, a little bit of a showcase on um, IPL, how that works. Um, ITZ, it is now 12 minutes past 8 in the morning here in uh, South Africa. Uh, you guys, what, an hour ahead of us? Behind us? Something like that? Um, okay, so we know the career. We did that in the last one. Um, that IPL was kind of exciting. That's the whole point of the, the Indian T20 League, is that it is uh, 20 uh, overs, limited 20 overs, and you've you've basically got to make the most runs you can. It's more of a batter's game than it is a bowler's game, but it, it is very exciting indeed. It's the same with the, the Big Bash League over uh, in Australia. Exactly the same thing. All of these are pretty much similar. I think that's the one that... I really think that one's in the UK. I can't remember Dream 11, unless it's something new. My biggest disappointment with this game is that. It's not nice. However, there is the Ashes to play, which is basically what this game is kind of based on. And then, of course, we get the world cup uh one day world cup uh, then you get the t20 and the test world championship and all that sort of stuff the one day world cup is uh slightly longer than the t20s 50 overs um as opposed to 20 overs so it's it's a good couple of hours of entertainment you got more time to build up your uh so on you know but uh yeah it's okay it's not that bad i'm just more disappointed in in the tour thing because I much prefer tests than I do to anything else, uh, because I'm old school. But um, yeah, that's that's very disappointing. That is. Um, what should we play? Uh, the Ashes. Yeah, it's uh, the Ashes is so long that that's tests as well as fifty overs and T twenties and whatever. We can do a World Championship and see how we go. Uh, we can do a T twenty World Championship as opposed to an IPL or any of the others. Play as play a world championship. Players controlling all teams. Play as a team, controlling one team. Let's do India for our friend over in India at the moment. Okay, you must select fifteen players to be part of your squad for this World Cup. Okay. Oh, good lord. Okay. Um. Have they chosen already? They've chosen already. Okay. They've chosen already. So that's fine. Okay. Okay, so why am, I, why am I looking at this? I don't want to look at this. Zimbabwe, New Zealand. Um, ITZ, no, I'm not going to. Uh, I don't have time for that, unfortunately. I've already said in the beginning. Um, not going to be uh, looking at going into that. Adding. Uh, so on. Okay. Let's give it a go. Let's see what we can do. Right. Hello and welcome, one and all. You join us for this 2020 match between India and Pakistan. I'm Adam Gilchrist, and alongside me today is Michael Atherton, Mel Jones, and the one and only Ali. So yeah, the, all the team names, um, players' names are all muddled because they obviously couldn't afford the licenses. 
showing a lot of faith in this batting uh, lineup. Anyway. Going first on this pitch, it's either a master stroke or a disaster waiting to happen. Well, the tension is extraordinary. The crowd oh, gets on the edge of their it's seats. Clear. So here it's we go. The players yeah. make their way out to a seismic crowd. They've waited all day for this match, and they're ready for some world-class family involvement. The pitch today, it looks good. A bit of grass on top, so they'll get their wish, I think. Just missed the line. Not the worst delivery, but that was dispatched with interest. Everyone just watched that in awe. Might look to go big again here. Hey, Danny how you doing, dude? Needs a dot ball. He does. I don't think he's going to get it, though. Beats the field with a great shot. Nicely fielded out deep on the boundary. Promised much insane. and really, in the end, delivered very little. Pretty disappointing all round. Before that wicket, the new batter comes charging out to the crease. They're quick to take guard and face up. Shot, not waiting around. That was seen so early. The timing was brilliant and that is stayed hit. Fantastic. That's just silly. The power on that shot is incredible. That's the sort of shot you want to see at a cricket match. Perfectly timed. Oh, end of the over. 22 off it. India, 22 for one. End of the first and an exceptional start. Some big shots early on. Can build some momentum easily off that over. Well, now that could be out. Out of the ground. That's a tremendous shot. Just sailed away. Hit that one on the up. A fabulous drive for six. I'd like to see them just aim for the top of off now. As a bowler, you've got to make them play on your terms. Smacks that away through the gap. Well, that was a poor delivery. You can't bowl there, and it got what it deserved. Boundary last ball. What's to come this delivery? I wonder. Brilliant shot. That's one for the crowd. Too much width, really. They're only asking for that to be hammered into the stands, uh, and that is games exactly the what's happened. Tried something a bit different last delivery, and the captain shouldn't mind that too much. If they get it right, they just might get that wicket. This is the second over of the first innings. Yep. Over the infield with a cracking shot. A direct hit, and this could be gone. Yeah, I'm just mucking about, just having a look at the different formats. Wanted to create a tour, uh, but it's just an absolute nightmare to set it up. That's all right. Is there enough on it? There is. Add that maximum to the scoreboard. Thank you very much. All the way. Got it right out of the middle. How will the bowler respond? Beautiful timing there off the front foot. It's racing away. The fielder out in the deep. There's some serious work to cut it off. 27 runs added in that over. India, 49 for one. 
Richardson. Tremendous start. Richardson. Bowlers have been asking questions and have answered with full honours. That is huge, enormous, massive, gigantic. Take a pick. Well, that's what you pay your entrance money for. It's blown into the crowd. A brilliant shot off the front foot. No need to move. Can he come back with a dot ball? Oh, that's a great shot early on. Wide right cover. And that'll give him a bit of confidence early on. Mate, pull up short of the boundary, though. You can't hit the ball much better yeah, than that. that. Timed it to I perfection. Think you can Keep it simple, line and length, and about off stump. That'll force a mistake. Misses everything. Really old guy. Come on. Oh, no ball. Jeez. What the hell? A lovely delivery. Got it in short and surprised them. They'll be happy only one of those is allowed. Uh, maybe even maybe 250. Who knows? We'll have to see. Great shot. That really wasn't a great delivery. Seen early and it was dispatched with a plum. Really playing all their shots that over. Very expensive. Still maintaining an impressive run rate. Fantastic start so far. Great shorter ball. Well played, though. Didn't flinch and was able to leave the ball comfortably. That's the end of the short stuff for this over. Yeah, there's only way they're going to get away with it. Oh, wow. Kick the bones out of that. It's gone for a maximum. That's just a brilliantly aggressive shot. Gets onto the front foot and it's flown over the boundary. Getting nice and settled at the crease now. Would have to be very happy with that last shot. Yep. Beats the field with a great shot. a big one and maximum away she goes if you lose the pictures it's because it's hit the broadcast track the runs are starting to come now really good shot for six this innings is starting to build how will he reply onto that early that could be four that is a master class of batting reads the length gets forward dispatches it to the boundary Ralph shouldn't be too worried about that last ball. They've got them playing their shots. Just need to tighten their areas now. Ah, oh, that's a biggie. Oh, that is huge. Dinner, every all day, the way for day. a maximum. And it's Four. gone many rows deep. Hit that so hard. Pressed forward, got the body shape right and launched it. One for the textbook. That's the end of the over. Just magical batting. Nothing the bowler can do other than watch the ball go all over the ground. Huge shot. That's a massive shot. Just incredible. Well, enough leverage there to get a good swing of the arms under it to get it over the rope. A good innings. Balls. That's 50. <laughs> Simple raise of the bats. Thumbs up yeah, to their batting partner, and they're ready to go again. Great commitment. Ah, they brought the guy in. Okay. Lovely cover drive. Straight to the extra cover fielder. Ah, they're taking him away now. Silly. Silly. Still honing in on their lines. The bats are happy to let it go through.
Six of your finest, please. Cover drive for a maximum. Brilliant. Just a little bit of room given, and the power was immense. That's flown over the boundary. Don't need to do anything special. Line and length is the key here. That's high. Is there enough on it? There is. Add that maximum to the scoreboard. Thank you very much. Well, that was just textbook. Finds the space and power to lift that ball over the top, and it just keeps going. That's the over. India, 113 for one. Another massive over. They've set up their team with an incredible platform now. Two straight. It's just been held on its way for a maximum. One shot there. This is some serious power hitting. Another six. Whatever they're trying out there to stop them just isn't working. 200, dude. There's another 15 overs to go. That was a tremendous delivery. Fizz through to the wicket keeper. No more short balls this over. That sounded good. That sounded really good. That's a maximum. It's gone 12 deep into the crowd. That's incredible. Just the power on that shot. That's the sort of thing you want to see in the crowd when you come to the cricket. Everyone just watched that and all. Top class innings. Been playing very nicely out there and brings up the half century. Got that away nicely. Good fielding out in the boundary. End of the over. Time for a little more freedom in the field. The captain can push this field a bit deeper now. Three more players able to go outside right, the circle. Yeah, yeah. This is where the right arm medium now. bowler is coming on to bowl from the north end. Yep. Great shot. It just looks so easy. Gets onto the front foot and eases through the ball. I can just stand and admire that shot. Straight drive, mid-off will cut that one off. Lovely cover drive, straight to the extra cover field. Well, that was a struggle, getting smacked all over the park. Going with spin now. Smacks that away through the gap. Threaded it through brilliantly, all timing on that shot. feel there was too much wrong with that last delivery. They just need to keep the ball in the right areas and the rewards will come. Yep. 
Lovely shot off the front foot. Deep extra cover has some work to do. Hers on the side of bowling, slightly fuller, and they've been put away. This delivery just needs to be pitched up on a length. Too short, and you're going to get punished on this pitch. Can't get that outside the ring field. That's a big one, a maximum, away she goes. If you lose the pictures, it's because it's hit the broadcast truck. Do they go full, do they go short? A lot to ponder this delivery after the boundary. Playing all their shots in that over, a very expensive over. It's been non-stop action tonight. Every plan for the batters has been dismantled with almost a level of disdain. Perfectly timed. No point running for that one. It was a four the moment it left the back. Beautiful shot off the front foot. Really wound up for that. Ball seemed to come onto the bat quicker than he thought. Yeah, I went for that shot because I didn't know how to duck. I haven't learned that yet. Yep. Head over the ball. Great shot. That's racing away. Great shot. It was a good length to try that, and they did that with maximum results. Six more. Just missed the line. Not the worst delivery, but that was put away with interest. That last ball isn't something you want to repeat of. You don't want to be giving away easy runs. Beats the field with a great shot. Needs a direct hit. If that had been thrown to the other end, I think you'd be looking at another wicket for sure. Didn't like the look of that one and just ignored it. End of the over, 14 runs coming from it. India, 176 for one. The right arm pace bowler is coming into the attack from the south end. Wide of extra cover, and away goes the ball to the boundary. <laughs> Two full punch back down the ground. Before that would score. That is so unfortunate. Pavilion for them. And this could be a huge swing of momentum. Lots of pressure coming into bat. They have to wait just a little bit longer to face their first ball, though. Cool. That's a ridiculous catch. <laughs> and that's gone. Amazing catch. So that's the third wicket down. Not a happy person walking off the field. There's a real feeling of disappointment. Coming to the wicket, they'll be looking to play within the V early and expand as they get settled. A little bit of wobble on that ball. It's safely taken by the keeper. Not enough on it to entice a shot, though. Onto the front foot. Super shot should be four. Four runs. They were so still at the crease. Just a slight movement forward, fabulous shot. Might look to go big again here. 
Nice shot. Straight to gully. A direct hit, and this could be gone. End of the over. Seven off it. India, 103 for three. The right arm is coming on to bowl from the north end. Lovely shot off the front foot. Deep extra cover has some work to do. You can't fault that shot. It's nicely played and it was four runs all the way. Don't always mind getting hit for runs. What's important is focus on getting the next delivery right. Wow, that's missed a lot. Lovely cover drive, straight to the extra cover fielder. Oh, wow. That is out of here. That could be out of the ground. That's just silly. The power on that shot is incredible. That's the sort of shot you want to see in a cricket match. Six lost ball. How will the bowler reply? Straight drive, mid-off will cut that one off. Someone different now to bowl at. Brings a different set of problems. I feel it's just a matter of pitching the ball up and getting them onto the front foot. Oh, that's been heaved away and punished over the rope. That's a brute of a maximum. Just missed the line. Not the worst delivery, but that was dispatched with interest. Everyone just watched that in awe. Really playing all their shots that over. Very expensive. It's been non-stop action tonight. Every plan for the batters has been dismantled with almost a level of disdain. It was timed well for four. Gee, that was a good shot. Tried something a bit different last delivery, and the captain shouldn't mind that too much. If they get it right, they just might get that wicket. No, no, no. Terrible shot. <laughs> I should have played across the line, but whatever. Beats the outside edge. Good bowling there. It's going to be another short one. Yep. Square cut. Finds point. No run. Six runs out of there. India, 206 for three. Ralph, back on now. the edge. Ralph, there with a great go. delivery there. Interesting. Combination of keys that's pressed there. Oh. Pakistan with a massive shout. Hey, it was going down the leg. There's no ways. Nice shot, pieces the infield. That was a lovely flowing drive through the covers to pick up the four. A uh, good contest here at the moment. Four off the last ball. It'll be interesting to see how the bowler can respond. Oh my, my, that's just flown off the middle. Well, the shorter ball doesn't work here. Rode the bounce well and eased it over the top for six runs. Getting nicely settled at the crease now. Would have to be very happy with that last shot. Waiting. Straight to the fielder. Yep. 
Wide of extra cover and away goes the ball to the boundary. Just sheer power off the back foot. They need to worry about running. The last one helped the scoring rate, making their intentions for this innings. End of the over. Shoe, 17 runs coming from it. India, 223 for three. No stone being left unturned by the batters. This will be a massive score. This bowler knows how to give the ball an almighty tweak. Let's see how they go. Up. And gone. Brilliant reactions to take that one. Simple as you like. The batter didn't bother to look at more than one delivery in that over. A fluent innings undone by a decent delivery. A good wicket to get at a good time. New batter comes to the crease. Never an easy time to come into bat after the fall of a wicket. Beats the bat. Jeez, how's that miss the stumps? Peach I'd like of a to delivery. Know that as well. How the hell did that miss? Well, now that could be out. Out of the ground. That's a tremendous shot. Just sailed away. Helped on its way, really. Pivoted onto the back foot and lofted it all the way. How will he reply? Lovely cover drive. Straight to the extra cover fielder. Cuts that off well in the infield. Yeah, way too early. I was looking at the field. The field setting, so placements. Not concentrating on the delivery. Yeah, over go. the infield with a cracking shot. End of the over, a big one. 11 runs coming from it. India, 234 for four. Starting to hit their stride. Fabulous piece of timing, and they're into the 20s. The right arm medium bowler is coming into the attack from the north end. Shot. Good timing and driven through the covers. Boundary last delivery. Is that the sign they're trying to push the run rate? It's your ass, bro. Yeah. Go through it. It's high in the air. Feel the carry around, but it looks like it'll carry. Showed good composure to wait on that slower ball and find room to get the four runs. Just a fantastic shot. Keeper. No more short balls this over. to adjust. Waits on it and drills it to the boundary. Does very well to quickly get across to this one. Wait on. 
Oh, fantastic catch. In the air, and cover takes an easy catch. Damn it, it was just too early. The idea was right to get over the inner field, but yeah. Starting to get interesting accurate. now. That's the fifth wicket, and a very frustrated person is heading back to the pavilion. Hmm? Wide of extra cover, and away goes the ball to the boundary. Caress that nicely through the gap to the boundary. Yeah, it can be very disheartening seeing good deliveries smacked around. Sometimes, though, you've just got to accept it and move on. Yep. Straight drive, mid-off will cut that one off. End of the over, seven runs coming from it. India, 257 for five. No stone being left unturned by the batters. This will be a massive score. Going with pace now. Oh my, that's racing away. The gap was left open for them and they were happy to oblige. Picked it early, got into position well and punched it to the boundary. How will the bowler respond? Still honing in on their lines. The batter happy to let it go through. Lovely cover drive, straight to the extra cover fielder. Brilliant shot, that's one for the crowd. Well, that ball has been hit. It's flown into the crowd. To get that much power coming forward onto the front foot is just ridiculous. A good innings, that's 50. A simple raise of the bats. Thumbs up to their batting partner, and they're ready to go again. Back-to-back -back boundaries. This time it's four. Magnificent hitting. Afridi has kept the pressure on in this over. Just needs to maintain the momentum going forwards. The right armour is coming into the attack from the south end. Six of your finest, please. Cut right for a maximum. Good. Crunch on the front foot and bang. We've got all the way. Down to last ball. What's to come this delivery? I wonder. see them just aim for the top of off now as a bowler you've got to make them play on your terms Wait. couldn't get it through the field yeah. onto that early that could be four the head was right and punched nicely through the ball. Don't need to do anything special. Line and length is the key here.
shoulders, arms, and through to the wicketkeeper. End of a high scoring over. Beautiful batting. After hitting the boundary that many times, there's high confidence out in the middle. That was a tremendous delivery. Fizz through to the keeper. No more short balls this over. Beats the cup of field. Nice shot. Yeah, too wide. It was there to be hit, and it was really given the treatment. I didn't feel there was too much wrong with that last delivery. They just need to keep the ball in the right areas, and the rewards will come. Got him. That's the one they wanted. Full swinging and straight through. Yeah, I tried a magic shot. Didn't happen, clearly. Oh, look at that swim. Lovely. Almost got it, though. I mean, you know. Really getting to the tail enders now. Sick wicket gone. There's not a lot left in this lineup. Doesn't matter the Difficult period as they come to the wicket. They'll take plenty of time to settle themselves in before facing their first ball. Shot, not waiting around. Hit that so hard. Pressed forward, got the body shape right and launched it. One for the textbook. 300. Can he come back with a dot ball? Finds the fielder with that shot. Sustained power hitting. What a finish that was. Final over. Left arm pace bowler is coming into the attack from the south end. Well, now that could be out. Out the ground. That's a tremendous shot. Just sailed away. Well, enough leverage there to get a good swing of the arms under it to get it over the rope. A lovely delivery, got it in short and surprised them. They'll be happy only one of those is allowed. Yes. That's huge, that's a biggie. It is out of here, absolutely smoked off the bat. Well, that's what you pay your entrance money for. It's flown into the crowd, a brilliant shot off the front foot. No need to move. Might look to go big again here. slower ball only gave them more time to see it and make sure of it don't always mind getting hit for runs what's important is focus on getting the next delivery right huge shot that's a massive shot just incredible this is a brilliant show of power batting oh, another six and the bowling tactics seem to be all wrong at the moment that's just a brilliantly aggressive shot. Gets onto the front foot and it's flown over the boundary. That is huge, enormous, massive, gigantic. Take the hit. That was seen so early. The timing was brilliant and that is stayed hit. Fantastic. And the innings comes to an end. Pakistan will need 338 runs. This is a massive total to chase. You have to stay positive, but the openers are going to have to get at it straight away. There can't be any settling in. Here we go. First ball. Doesn't beat the infield. Wow, that's 
missed a lot. No, 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 terrible shot. Great commitment. Edge, but it drops safely. Time to follow up after such a great delivery. Pitch it on a length is obviously the way to go. That's great fielding. That ball was flying. Well, that's the end of a great display of bowling. No score from it. Nicely putting pressure on the batters. Yeah, big opportunity. They've worked really hard in recent weeks. They should have the confidence to build an in innings and get a big score on the board. Flex that one, simple as you like, inside the ring. Misses everything. Got that away nice. forward, fabulous shots. A poor delivery, and you don't pass up chances like that. Crashed away for four. Oh, great ball there, but it'll find the gap. Let's just see if they can get that ball up into the slot as before. It's so crucial. You've got to follow up that last delivery and keep the batter under pressure. Eight runs out of there. Pakistan are eight for nine. Second over down in the power play, and they're off to a sluggish start with the bat. There's been a good mix of bowling variations, though. Straight to the fielder. Oh my, that's racing. You can't fault the bowling. Sometimes your opponent is just too good. Wonderful front foot shot. There's no point chasing that. Errs on the side of bowling slightly fuller, and they've been put away. Can't get that outside the ring field. Head over the ball, great shot, that's racing one. Threaded it through brilliantly, all timing on that shot. Do they go full, do they go short? A lot to ponder this delivery after the boundary. Oh, I thought that was passing, but a fantastic dive to cut it off. Eight runs added in that over. Pakistan, 16 for none.
Cuts that off well in the infield. Driven on the onside, but straight to mid-wicket. here at the moment. Four off the last ball. It'll be interesting to see how the bowler can respond. Edge, but it drops safely. End of the over. Six runs coming from it. Pakistan, 22 for none. Lovely cover drive, but straight to the extra cover fielder. Got that away nicely. Needs a direct hit. Goes over the top with that shot. Starting to hit their stride. Fabulous piece of timing, and they're into the 20s. That was a boundary the moment the ball left the bat. Can't time that any better. Perfection. How will he reply? He's quick onto that in the infield. 11 runs added there. Pakistan, 33 for none. So that's the fifth over of the power play completed. Yeah. Great shot. Gets a hold of that and places it through square leg. What a great shot that was. Onto the front foot really quickly. No stopping that one. That last ball isn't something you want to repeat of. You don't want to be giving away easy runs. Does very well to quickly get across to this one. Well, the bowler pulls out of the delivery. Something mustn't have felt right. Beats the bat. Jeez, how's that miss the stumps? Peach of a delivery.
five runs in that over. Pakistan, a 38 for none. India can now have five fielders outside the circle. This field's looking for more balance between attack and defence. of a productive Finally innings. Got one. Didn't quite Finally. ignite into fireworks as we would have hoped, Been but the field, still then. solid work. Does it. The field will come up now, you'd think. Pressure should be on as the new batter strides to the middle. They'll be looking for another quick wicket. Lovely cover drive, straight to the extra cover fielder. Nine runs added in that over. Pakistan, a 47 for one. Well, there is a saying, you can't direct the wind, but you can change your sails. Might be time to accelerate if they want to have a chance still. through the field. Finds a fielder with that shot. Over Pakistan, 55 for one. A new bowler is coming into the attack.
brilliant diving stop. but it drops safely. Wow, that's a huge appeal for the catch. If there's something on it, it was the finest of edges. Oh, well, that's just outrageous. Well, the end of an entertaining performance with the bat. Certainly a good wicket to get. Those runs were really starting to flow. And with that wicket, the new batter will mark centre. Just needs to rotate the strike early on as they get settled into their innings. Three runs added in that over. Pakistan, a 58 for two. It's been a bit of a battle finding some big overs, but they work the ball around nicely. Beats the field with a great shot. Nice shot, just a flick off the pads. Well, what a lovely shot. It flew to the boundary. That's clearly not the type of delivery to be bowling here. Can he come back with a dot ball? Respond. Great shot through the gap. Glanced away nicely, but fine short, fine leg. End of the over, and a very nicely bowled one. Not much opportunity to score runs there. Straight drive, mid-off will cut that one off. Doesn't beat the infield. the pavilion a disappointing display in the end for someone with such batting skills this one goes down as a fail first ball for the batter coming in goes over the top with that shot funny thing is he's not even a bowler so yeah that was just pure luck but, sure, take it. Flex that one, simple as you like, inside the ring. That's the end of the over. Two runs added. Pakistan for 72 for three. Well, there is a saying, you can't direct the wind, but you can change your sails. It might be time to accelerate if they want to have a chance still. Bowling 
midfielders look really confident. Bowler seems convinced it was a good shout. You know what? They came close. off his arm. That should be out. Was there an edge? This could be trouble. It was never in line. I'm not hearing anything on this. That could be trouble. Zaman, looking quite Came surprised, didn't seem too Four. worried about a reversal. Whatever. Oh, jeez. Across the line. What the hell? Nice shot, pierces the infield. Came forward under the front foot and eased it away to the boundary. Don't always mind getting hit for runs. What's important is just focus on getting the next delivery right. Oh my, that's racing away. End of the over, 10 off it. Pakistan, two for three. It was full and good night. Hit it well to pick up four. That's a strong appeal. What's the umpire's decision? Across the stumps and a flick of the wrist. It's wide square leg. Could be four. Over the infield with a cracking shot. <laughs> Lovely cover drive, but straight to the extra cover fielder. chat with the captain. Not sure this one is worth a review, though. I, I don't know. No, I didn't so. pick up on anything there. Very close to the bat, though. Was there a bat on it? Fielders think there was. This could oh, be trouble. just missing. Bloody hell. That is close. That was close. Oh, well. No more reviews. Yeah, not the best of reviews there. Great call by the umpire, though. Jeez, time that one. That showed great skill. Lovely timing. The boundary was the only place that ball was heading. End of the over. Seven off it. Pakistan. Over nine. Okay, let's have a look at our presets. We're not in a power play. Or are we? Um, are we in a power play? Well, we're three. Middle overs haven't been kind. They've been bogged down and required rates has climbed. The captain making some adjustments to the field here. Straight to the field. Oh, come on. The whole team's gone oh, up here. Him, Nick. What's the umpire going to say? Wow. Uh,
Beats the field with a great shot. They've gone up here. Come on. Oh. Jeez. No abuse. Smacks that away through the gap. Nicely fielded out deep on the boundary. Over Pakistan. And 91 for three. Runs have been at a premium this middle portion of the match. It's a brilliantly aggressive shot. Gets on the front foot and it flies over the boundary. Magical shot into the back of the position. I do not think anyone's going to stop that. This is a masterclass of batting. Reads the length, gets forward, dispatches it to the boundary. Edge, but it drops safely. Time to follow up after such a great delivery. Pitch it on length is obviously the way to go. Goes over the top with that shot. You can't fault the bowling. Sometimes your opponent is just too good. That is a beautiful front foot shot. No point in chasing that one. Great shot through the gap. Perfectly timed. No point running for that one. It was a four the moment it left the bat. Beautiful shot off the front foot. Really playing all their shots that over. Very expensive. Might look to go big again here. Great shot. Threaded it through brilliantly. All timing on that shot. Here they go full. Okay, so max outfields. Okay, so we can get some boundary uh, fielders out there. Let's go with that. They go short. A lot to ponder this delivery after the boundary. Going more defensive now with the field choice. Got that away nicely. Well, that one's for the textbook. Stands tall on top of the bounce. And a lovely flick of the wrist at the end. Caress that nicely through the gap to the boundary. Yep. Oh, a little full, let's go be four runs. Goes on the side of bowling, slightly fuller, and it didn't put away. Ahmed has gotten a big shot away this over. Now they can focus on playing the next ball on its merits. Ahmed has hit that ball and he'll run right away for four final on the chart. Get near that one. You can't fault the bowling. Sometimes your opponent is just too good. Wonderful front foot shot, and there's no point chasing that. Lovely cut drive straight to the extra cover field. movement forward fabulous shots how will he reply go for it try to go large with that slot sweep and tip well enough to be four he can't fault that shot nicely played and it was four runs all the way beats the bat Jeez, how has that missed the stumps? Peach of a delivery. He's 
If we go into that in the infield. Into the gap and finds Barry. Wonderful shot in the field. Well, that was a very solid shot. Read the length early to get onto the front foot and that raced away for four. A good innings, that's 50, a simple raise of the bats, thumbs up to their batting partner and they're ready to go again. Doesn't even wait to see if the ball's going to do anything. Onto the front foot, punches it away to the boundary. It's a full toss and worked off the pegs nice and the world before. That was a boundary the moment the ball left the bat. Yeah, Can't find so that any nice better. Balls. Perfection. End of the over, and what a beauty it was. Say what you want about the bowling, you still have to hit them. Majestic batting. The batters have controlled the middle portion of this innings, but they'll need to launch now with wickets in the dugout. What a shot. He hit that one hard. No need to run. Pushed onto the front foot and presented the full face of the bat. Don't need to do anything special. Line and length is the key here. Massive outside edge. Just got to follow up that last delivery. Found the edge, but no reward, but putting pressure on the batter. Big edge. Wow. Time to keep the pressure on now. Great ball, that last one, to find the edge. It's just a case of finding the same spot. No, no, no. Terrible shot. Let's just see if they can get that ball up into the slot as before. It's so crucial. You've got to follow up that last delivery and keep the batter under pressure. Zaman drills that one away. That would be four more of the time. Got that one. Clean out of the middle. Four of a brilliant shot. Nine runs added in that over. Pakistan, 156 for three. Whacked away. It just looks so easy. Gets onto the front foot and eases through the ball. I can just stand to the mind. A strong area for them, lifted it up and over towards the rope. the boundary. Brilliant shot there. You just can't leave it any better than that. Beautiful shot. No chance at all for the fielders. A poor delivery and you don't pass up chances like that. Crashed away for four. Edge, but it drops safely. A nice and take and catch in the slips. Wow, what a catch. Absolute screamer. Diving away to the side and keeping his balance as well. It's another wicket, the fourth now. Sometimes you've just got to accept that you couldn't do anything about a delivery. A new batter always likes to feel bad on ball as they bring a bit of nervous energy to the wicket. Edged it. End of a high scoring over. Beautiful batting. After hitting the boundary that many times, there's high confidence out in the middle. They're behind the required rate late in the innings. No other choice now but to just go for it. Yeah. Nicked it. That's a strong appeal. What's the umpire's decision? What a catch. The 
A great innings coming to an end. Brilliant scoring. It was a very entertaining performance. We'll have to head back to the pavilion. Have to go for it now. Oh, that's a great shot early on. Wide of cover. That'll give him a bit of confidence early on. Make him up short of the down here. Well, what a lovely shot. It flew to the boundary. That's clearly not the type of delivery to be bowling here. Misses everything. They really need a boundary, this ball. Lovely cover drive. Straight to the extra cover. Extra cover with a fantastic catch. The batter is kicking himself. And out. Oh, how did he get to that one? Well, this is a fantastic wicket. Kept the runs down, really didn't get settled and looked to be in trouble for most of the knock. And with that wicket, we'll see a change out in the middle. The task here will be that of support and getting themselves settled into their innings. But anyway, there we go. As I said, it's just a showcase of um, what's available in the game and things like that. I'm still going to carry on with my career, but not in this session. Uh, that'll be for another time. But uh, pretty cool. Um, I think the World Championship is a lot more exciting uh, than the career, to be honest. But it's always nice to play the career to see how far you can get and if you can get into your national squad and things like that. But I appreciate you guys uh, joining me today. I uh, hope you have a fantastic day wherever you are. And uh, a little later, I'll be trying some other games. So uh, keep an eye on the channel. I'm not sure what yet, but uh, there'll definitely be something else. Anyway, I appreciate you guys hanging out. And I'll see you again real soon. Cheers, everybody.